What's up and welcome to another edition of Soul Heads. Thanks for tuning in. Today, man, we're going to do this one kind of quick. Uh, not a lot to talk about when you got a sample in there. So yeah, we got the orange traditional Nike box. That so proper clean swoosh. We'll get straight into what we got. I'm going to break it down. So uh, it's a sample kick that I got from the Folsom Outlets uh, by Sacramento. Um, they're quoting that it was $59.99 in their spot. Uh, it's a size 10 and it's the Air Max Accelerate. They dropped their price from $59.99 to $34.97. And when I was in there, I got an additional 20% off, I believe. So I think I paid about 24 bucks for these shoes. So uh, when a sample comes out, traditionally it's just one size. And um, they test drive it, they shop it, I guess, and then uh, they 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 sell them. So anyway, uh, we'll get right into this, man. You know how I do. I'm gonna bust them out for you and get this cracking. So uh, I'm breaking these out today because I've been sleeping on them for about three, four months now, and um, that's a dope shoe. I'm, re I'm really liking that colorway. Uh, it's a charcoal gray. It's what, what is it? The anthrac anthracite, whatever, if that's how you say it. And it's like a straight up construction orange. It's literally a little, little bit brighter than the box itself. Um, as you can see, I went ahead and laced one up. Show you how I do. Get one going for you. You know, so um, got the traditional dead stock style. Got this little tab in. I don't know what's up with that. There's a tag in there saying, you know, men's color, whatever. I don't even know uh, how to break it down when we're talking about a, a sample shoe because there's no official colorway written on it. There's uh, only what I see and what you see. So um, I was I was out at the outlets. I was checking it out, seeing what's good. One of the employees, man. Uh, it's a little tip. You guys should hit them up because they pull stuff to the back. If they see it on the floor, they try to save it for themselves. So uh, if you let them know that you're interested, typically they'll come out with some hidden heat, which, uh, you know, you're not going to see a sample shoe at a at an outlet or a Nike store on a, on, a, on a, any random given time. So uh, since we looked at the other one, we'll go ahead and check it out. It's the Fist Soul 2. Um, start off with the tongue. You got the Nike Accelerate. Uh, Nike, uh, Nike, Nike stitched on on a tab and stitched on there. Uh, this is kind of fat, man. I haven't even slipped my uh, foot in it, but this is just when you see a fat, thick tongue, you know it's comfortable. So it got that meshing all the way through. We got that oval lacing. We got that breathable mesh all the way around. Uh, believe it to be some hyperfuse, some little hyperfuse on there. Uh, I don't know, just your standard sole. I don't know if that's like a a lunar material or not, Air Max airbag. I'm sure that bubble goes in. Something comfortable. Got that traditional Air Max on the back. We got the the little baby swoosh on the the inner side, inner uh, inner panel siding, and more meshing to go around. Sock liners, all that bright bright orange. Uh, Got to mention that big swoosh on the other side, the opposite side on the front. Um, you know, I, I, I thought about how I was going to explain this because I know that I've seen these go for, I think it was 159 I, I know I've seen them for effect for 129 I thought I saw them on Nike.com not too long ago, but I was just looking a minute ago to see if I could do some homework on it so I could tell you a little more about it in detail. But they're just not on there. There's no accelerates on there at all. And I don't know if it's a sleeper shoe, if it's a shoe that people ain't liking or what, but I plan on wearing these tomorrow. And I was like, you know what, let me get this review out the way. So, um, yeah, it's a Nike Accelerate Air Max. It's a sample shoe. Came in a size 10. I don't even know if that's the real box because look at the shoe. That box is way bigger than the shoe. And uh, when they're sitting in there side by side, they're not even a good fit. The box barely closes. I actually put some tape on the on the inside just to be able to uh, make it sit proper and clean. So um, I'm assuming it got the Air Max. It got to be comfortable. 
I just thought it'd be a, you know, a cool, just, you know, what a round shoe, whatever, you know, just a whatever shoe. So, um, yeah, to give you a proper hit on the bottom, you know, soul heads and all, you know how we do. It's like, man, you got some, some orange tread on the outside. On the inside, you got the same style treading, but just in black with some grooves. It does have the Nike Plus on there. If you're really feeling that like that, um, you know, you like to track your work and see what, see what you're doing. I like this uh, this little heel kick plate. Some people tend to drag their their foot a little when they walk. So this is, oh, my bad. Uh, this is pretty thick. This is pretty thick. So if you're one of those uh, people that drag your, your heel when you walk, it's not like it's intentional or anything. It's just part of your posture. Um, you know, I think this would be a good look for you. I, I, I know if, I'm pretty positive if I hit the light on this, 3M, 3M hits. Got another little 3M hit on top. Yeah, that light's already popping right there. Yeah, that's 3M. Yeah, for sure, those are 3M. So, um, you know, just, just switching it up a little bit, showing you what, what I what I be grabbing, things I run into. You know, hit up all your famous Nike spots, all, all your local Nike spots, whether it's an outlet or a tr true Nike town, Nike store. Um, you never know what you could run into. So we're going to go ahead and wrap this up. And I'm going to catch you on the next one. And we're going to do it again. All right, so heads. Uh -huh. Thanks for watching.